Welcome back once again to James Excel videos. We are still continuing with the basic functions. Whereby in this time round we are going to look at the average number of ID student fees, the highest ID fee paid, and the lowest ID fee paid. Now, before you look at that, you might need to fill up all this data to be able to get the information you want. That brings us to something new something known as fuel handling using formulas. If I wanted to finish up the rest of these computations, I needn't have to go on computing one by one. I would simply come and click in the last one and double click, then Excel will do the rest. Notice that when it does something like this, it means the figure is not fitting in the cell. When you point there, you see that the figure is displayed, but the cell is not displaying so you simply come and expand the column so the same story can happen here you can point at the bottom right hand corner and you double click and it will do the rest or you can point at the bottom right hand corner and you drag down that can also work or I always prefer double clicking point at the bottom right hand corner Notice the shape of the pointer it has to be that black crosshair. Double click. So basically, that is how we do that. Now back to our average. We want to know the average ID fees. So I'll put my equal sign. Come back to the FX. I can look for average in this it's there I can click in it then I'll come and highlight all my ID money spent then I'll say okay and this is the average fees paid by the fees spent on IDs then supposing I want the highest ID fee, the cost which paid most money in the ID fees. So I'll put my cosines. I can still come back to my FX. This time around I use the max function. So I'll choose max from the list. Then I'll come and still highlight my ID monies and I would say okay so this will be the biggest figure in the list if you go ahead and cross check how about the smallest still do the same thing come to fx this time round it's supposed to look for mean if it's not there we'll highlight here grab this away type mean click ok it will add me uh, say the put eco science choose type our mean up here say all then go mean will be displayed say okay still come and highlight our ID fees and okay so this here is the smallest figure. So that is how we do the average, the highest, and lowest fees. Uh, we can also do this in a shorter way if we don't pass through the FX. Um, I could take this away. I put, I would come right here. We should be on home come to this drop down arrow here then you choose average then I'll highlight the figures whose average I want then I say enter and I'll get my average the same applies here I can come choose max then highlight ID figures and enter notice that we still get the same answer 
and the formula remains the same. So basically that is how we do that. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video, don't forget to subscribe and like.